Hi y'all. I am um, still working on that pork chop meal that I was uh, talked to you about yesterday, but this is some of the side dishes and I'm going to show them to you also. I'm making a cabbage casserole that's easy and it's different than just your smothered cabbage and it's very yummy. <clears throat> Doesn't take a lot of ingredients. You need a small cabbage head and shred it or chop it. A medium sized onion chopped or more if you like it. A half a stick of butter melted, half a teaspoon of salt, a fourth cup of mayonnaise, and a can of cream of mushroom soup. Now what you're going to do is you're going to mix your salt, your mayonnaise, and your mushroom soup and stir that together. Okay, I've shredded or just kind of sliced my cabbage head and I've got it in my 9 by 13 and I've sprayed it with some cooking spray. Then you're going to take your onion and I put black pepper on top of it of course. And you're just going to put your onion on top of your cabbage and you could caramelize the onion if you wanted to but I didn't do that today. Put the onion on the top. And then you're going to want to, um, the next thing that you do, you take your mixture of your cream of mushroom soup and your mayonnaise. I added a tablespoon of onion powder to it just for some extra flavor. You're just going to spread that on top of your cabbage. great side dish. We're going to have this with the Bourbon Street pork chops that I showed y'all yesterday. Okay. Now, I've got that all in there. And what we're going to do next is, in this bowl, I've got one sleeve of um, buttery crackers. And I used the Waverly Wafers, what do they call them? Club crackers. Keebler's Club Crackers. And a cup of your choice of cheese. I used the Mexican blend. And you're going to melt one stick of butter and stir it in with it. And I've done that. Then you're just going to top your um, cabbage with these... Uh, cracker crumbs and cheese. You're going to put it in the oven and bake it for about 45 minutes. And uh, it's going to get brown, your cabbage is going to get cooked, and it's going to be delicious. I'll bring y'all back when I bring it out of the oven. Here's the cabbage casserole out of the oven. It's still very hot. I will dish some up here in a minute and show y'all what it looks like. Okay, y'all, here's the cabbage casserole. I've got a helping of it dished up. The cabbage is tender, crisp, and flavored very, very well. And the crumbs on the top are just yummy. So that's a new one for y'all to try. Maybe. Maybe it's new to you. It may not be. Okay, now you have the side dish to go with the Bourbon Street pork chops. The, cap the cabbage casserole is really yummy. So I hope y'all will try the recipe. If you do, leave me a comment down there and let me know. Hit the like button. And please uh, watch my videos and share them on Facebook or your social media with your friends. And um, I would appreciate that because I'm trying to grow my channel and I need watchers as well as subscribers. I hope y'all have a blessed day. Hope you've got good food on your table. Hope you spend time with your family. Cut off all your devices and just spend family time. It won't hurt to give your family one hour in the evenings or at lunchtime whenever y'all are all together and make some memories. Don't forget to say your blessing. Thank the good Lord for all he's done. I pray he'll keep his hand on you, bring y'all right back here tomorrow for a new video, and you walk in his blessings.